Alright, welcome guys to my let's play of Indiana Jones and the Fate of Atlantis where we left off. We were stumped and then as I was editing it, editing Pa was like, recording Pa, you missed it. You totally missed the oblivious thing you were supposed to do and it's like, oh shit I did. <laughs> so, yeah, I, yeah, I figured out what I need to do. Definitely didn't see it when I was playing it. Um, so we gotta go back to, um, oh wait, the vehicle, the car. We gotta go back to the other place, uh, the one with the tourists. Come on, let's go. A uh, booth. I forget what the place is called. Uh, Tikal. Um, so let's go over here. Hi, bird. You're gonna be my best friend. Let's get that guy out. Stop! I'm begging your pardon. You can't go in there. The temple isn't safe. Okay, so talk to... You? Excuse me. Yes? And then, uh, explore the temple? I'd really like to explore the temple. Tell me the name of the Lost Dialogue of Plato. I don't know the title. I don't know the title. Plato! Obviously, you're not serious about this. So now let's go talk to the bird. Yes, I have to talk to the bird. Title. Title? Hermocrates! A friend of Socrates! There we go. Okay, so let's get the guy back out. Stop! Excuse me, the temple isn't open to the public. Listen. Yes? About exploring the temple. Tell me the name of the lost dialogue of Plato. Alright, there it is. The Hermocrates. That's it. Well now, perhaps I was wrong. You seem to know what you're doing. Walk this way, please. I don't trust this guy, Indy. I know what you mean. Come on. Here we are. Let's see what you can do. Okay. So, I can talk to him. Let's talk to him and see what will happen. Also, quick disclaimer, Stella is being a cabin crazy Stella because it's been cold these past couple weeks, like polar vortex, minus 50 at night, extreme, please, province of uh, Alberta, please stop using your power at certain times to prevent us from, like, restarting the grid, kind of serious cold. And, I mean, she doesn't go out in the winter anyways, but we're starting to see the, um, she's bored. Our indoor-outdoor cat is bored. <laughs> so she may be running around on my desk trying to get my attention, because Stella do what Stella do. Well, the Great Pyrenees has been cooped inside as well, because polar vortex. It was a fun week of being at home with all the animals inside and small child and not going anywhere for a week. Anywho, let's talk to... Sternhart, let's let's get the ball rolling. Sorry, I'm rambling. I always ramble. Say there. Yes. Okay, so from the top. Don't you have to keep an eye on your store? Oh, I'm sure it's safe. I'd much rather keep an eye on you. Oh, hey, I want to talk to you further. Say there. Yes. Or is this the whole? Okay, there we go. More dialogue. So you've never found anything here? No, I'm stumped. Uh, I'd like, I like to talk to you further. Why is it breaking me out of the dialogue? There's dialogue I want to talk to you about. Say there. Yes? What was the purpose of this chamber? You have me there. Some sort of crypt? Listen. There's not much more to talk about. Carry on, Dr. Jones. 
Do I have to separate and like have Sophia go outside and Indy stay in here maybe? Um, we got some things to look at. So let's look at the animal head. Looks like it could use a nose. Okay. Anything else? The spiral designs are our next thing. So let's look at that. Engraved symbols of water and life. Okay. Uh, can I push one of these? I can't move it. How about pull? I can't. Years of tarnish have it all gummed up. Okay. Uh, open? It doesn't seem to open. Okay, let's look at the animal head. And uh, look, uh, we'll pull on it. I can't move it. Okay, we'll push. I can't move it. Or open. It doesn't seem to open. Pick up? I can't pick that up. Okay, so let's talk to Sophia. Can I talk to you, Sophia? What's up? Ah, there we go. Okay. Could you talk to Sternhardt and keep him occupied? Okay. Dr. Sternhardt, I'd like to speak to you. Okay, so let's leave. Uh, let's go grab that lantern. Oh, not talk to. Uh, pick up lamp. Good thing that pest Sternhardt's not around. Anything else I can grab? Doesn't look like it. Okay. So back in the temple. Excuse me, won't you? Let's see what your friend is up to. Okay, uh, let's look at... It's a lamp filled with kerosene. So, you took my lamp, eh? Oh, shoot. I hope you know what you're doing. Uh, oops. I... oops. Um, okay. I did not mean to... I mean, I mean, meant to look at it. I didn't think he would see it. Oops. Excuse me, Sophia. So what can I do here? What's up? Now let's keep looking. Fine. Do I need to trade the lamp? With the gentleman at the other site? Looks like it could use a nose. Actually, can we talk to you about that animal? Say there. There's not much more to talk about. Carry on, Dr. Jones. Shoot, okay. Uh... Doesn't seem to close. Engraved symbols of water and life. Water and life. And this needs a nose, apparently. Uh, can I... pick up the animal head? I can't pick that up. I can't move it. Well, that doesn't seem to work. The kerosene won't pour out. Open lamp? It's my favorite piece of equipment. It's already open. Okay, uh, let's look at the kerosene lamp. Better not spill the kerosene. So can I use it on this now? Look, the kerosene ate away the tarnish. Remarkable! Ah, okay, so I can push? I can't move it. Was it pull? Now I got it. Marvelous! Okay, so let's look at... It's a stone carving. Okay, so now what? <laughs> Engraved symbols of water and life. Can I pick up the other one, maybe? I can't pick that up. I can't move it. I can't move it. No, okay, can I use it? With that? 
It fits perfectly. Now it looks kind of like an elephant. Amazing. Ah, okay, so push. It won't go any farther. Pull? Look at that! Astonishing! Bless my soul, the tomb of an Atlantean king! Here's a small stone disc with images of land and sea engraved on it. I do believe it's a world stone. At last I have the thing. Goodbye, fellow seekers. Wait! Oh no, he got away! Oh, was I supposed to keep him distracted? Oh no. Oh no, was I supposed to keep him distracted? I mean, I could go back, could reload. Uh, we'll go look at this. Um, or I can live with my mistakes. Look at the bead. Looks like a bead of oracalcum. Uh, so can we pick it up? Too bad for Sternhardt. He missed the oracalcum bead. Who knows? Maybe it is the tomb of an Atlantean king. Okay. Uh, let's continue. We'll go with. We'll continue with my mistake. I have one bead. Um. Let's see if we can give it to Sophia. I can't. Uh, shoot. Mistakes were made. Um. Actually, can I pursue him? I don't think I can. Oh, secret door. Oh, there we go. Uh, look at secret door. It's almost invisible. Uh, open. It won't budge. Push. It won't budge. Pull. It won't budge. Dance. Close. Doesn't seem to close. Okay, so I don't think I can go through it. He has disappeared. Shoot, I should have kept him distracted. Okay, well... We'll see how far I can get. But I am curious if there was an alternate path to that puzzle. Let's find the airport. I don't think there would be an alternate path, um, but we're, we can always check it out. Um, so I need to give this guy something, but I don't know what. You know what? Let's just quickly. Um, well, we could have planned that better. Uh, sorry. Let's save. Um, I'm curious. I need to know. Um, also, I, I, it occurred to me, I have two things to bring up, since I totally forgot. One, for, in regards to this game, this was viewer requested, uh, someone from my Twitch streaming uh, chat, words are great, uh, a long, 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 long time follower uh, has been recommending this game a lot, so I figured I'd give it a shot, so blame I. Uh, and then, uh, second of all, the saving actually works now. I don't know what happened. It works. Uh, when I went on Steam's, like, I think Steam's or GOG's forums about it, because there's a forum asking about issues with saving, um, someone said, like, your keyboard, you have to change it to, like, American keyboard. That was one option. Uh, you hit like alt something. I can't remember, but I got it to work. I don't know what happened. It, it magically worked after I um, rambled about it on a, in a Twitch stream. It, it magically worked. So yeah, it worked. Okay, so I need to know. I'm curious. Let's go back. Oh wait, no, load. Stomp. Okay, sorry. I, I'm so curious. Let's, let's just see. I need to be humored. Can I distract him and we can get like the world stone and everything? Or does he just grab it? Come and on, go? let's go. Because it almost seems like I could distract him and do all that stuff. Um, so let's. let's I'm, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm curious. Stop! Begging your pardon, you can't go in there. The temple isn't safe. 
to talk to you. Excuse me. Yes? I'd really like to explore the temple. Tell me the name of the lost dialogue of Plato. I don't know the title. Plato! Well, at least you're an honest man. Okay, so parrot. Uh, title. Title? Hermocrates! A friend of Socrates! Stop! Excuse me, the temple isn't open to the public. Talk again. Excuse me. Yes? About exploring the temple. Tell me the name of the lost dialogue of Plato. Okay, so, uh, that one. The Hermocrates. That's it. Is there any way I can skip the dialogue? I don't think there is. Spacebar? Well, nope. now perhaps I was wrong. You seem to know what you're doing. Spacebar pauses please. the game. Okay, so. I don't trust this guy, Indy. I know what you mean. Come on. Here we are. Let's see what you can do. Okay, so we need to talk to Sophia. Can I talk to you, Sophia? What's up? Could you talk to Sternhardt and keep him occupied? Okay. Dr. Sternhardt, I'd like to speak to you. Pick up lamp. Good thing that pest Sternhardt's not around. Okay, so let's see what happens. I need to know. I'm I'm curious. Excuse me, won't you? Let's see what your friend is up to. Uh, talk to Can Sophia. I talk to you, Sophia? Sophia? Unless you won't. Unless it's the whole. What's up? As soon as you hit like. Here he comes back. Curious. Could you try and keep Sternhardt busy again? <sighs> again? He's such a windbag. I've got another question for you, Doctor. Okay, so open. Use. Excuse me, won't you? Let's see what your friend is up to. So, you took my lamp, eh? I hope you know what you're doing. So I had to keep him distracted with like... Look, the kerosene ate away the tarnish. Remarkable! Now I got it! Marvelous! Okay. It fits perfectly. Now it looks kind of like an elephant. Amazing! Now let's talk to Sophie. Sophia. Sophia, let's talk. What's up? Could you try and keep Sternhardt busy again? <sighs> again? He's such a windbag. I've got another question for you, Doctor. Okay. So I need to push the pole, I think it was. Pole. Look at that! Oh, nope. Okay. Never mind. No matter what I do. Bless my soul. The tomb of an Atlantean king! Okay. So that answers my question. A small stone disc with images of land and sea engraved on it. I do believe it's a world stone. Okay, in that case, let's just load up my file. So, regardless. Okay, that's good to know. Um, I know there's multiple endings, I think, to this game. Uh, Let's find the airport. I just don't know how far those multiple, you know, points go. Or paths, I should say. Um, so I need... Something to trade with him. Do I go back to the museum? Do we go artifact dig dig digging at the museum?
I guess I do. Okay. Uh... Nothing up here but a few broken pots. I see something that I could take. I think. No, nothing there. Uh, look at shelves. Here's a cartouche from the Well of Souls. Uh, do I take it? I don't need anything here. Okay, how about something from here? I can't pick that up. Oh, the trunk. Uh, let's go get that. Uh, look at trunk? It's my old steamer trunk. Open trunk? Uh, look at trunk? Nothing useful in here. Pick up trunk? I can't pick that up. Okay, so no, I can't. Oh, ice box. Let's look at the ice box. Look at ice box. It's my old ice box. I haven't used it in months. Phew. Guess I should have cleaned it out. Oh, so what's in the ice box? A jar. I guess it's mayonnaise, but it looks like used motor oil. Okay. I guess it's mayonnaise, but it looks like used motor oil. Interesting. So nothing in the trunk. I think that's it. Shelves. Nothing on there. We can look at the window. I better call a glazier. Okay, so I guess that's it. Huh. I guess we're out of here then. So maybe I can give the kerosene lamp to the gentleman here. If not, I got a jar of mayonnaise. Maybe interest in the mail. Okay, so open door. Mr. Costa? You again? What do you want? Uh, trade. Let's talk about a trade. Okay, what you got? Oh, the bead. Just in case. I'm offering this ancient coppery bead. Bead, you say? A mere bead for the unique knowledge I possess? You'll have to do better than that. Come back when you've got something worth my while. Shoot, okay. Don't say anything. Okay, so let's go back to Iceland and maybe see if anything's changed there. Come on, let's go. Pickles. Okay, something to change. Okay. Uh, oh my. Too bad. He's frozen solid. A little too dedicated to his work, I guess. Uh. I can't pick that up. I can't move it. I can't move it. Okay, so you can't do anything with him at all. Okay. It looks like Heimdall managed to chip the eel head free. So, push. I can't move it. Pull. I can't move it. Uh, you figure. 
Okay, we see, we can look at the eel head, and then the figure in ice. It looks like Heimdall managed to chip the eel head free. It looks like a bead would fit in the eel's mouth. Oh, hey, we have a bead. Okay, use bead. The eel head. It fits perfectly. Whoa! Look, it melted itself right out of the ice. Okay, so pick up. And look at eel. It's a bronze coil. So I guess we're done here. Okay. Interesting. So maybe that's why I need to trade. Then. Actually, before I leave, is there anything I can take off the guy? I don't think there was. No. Okay. So I guess we'll get out of here. And then head to... Let's head for the airport. The other place? And maybe trade the snake. Sorry, I think I repeated myself there. Uh, <laughs> huh. Hopefully this works. Mr. Costa? You again? What do you want? A uh, trade. Let's talk about a trade. Okay. What you got? I'm offering this mysterious eel figurine. Now that looks interesting. You've got a deal, mister. Now listen carefully. I don't know exactly where to find it, but... The Lost Dialogue of Plato is in the Sprague Collection, got that? I think so, the Sprague Collection. Very good, nice doing business with you. The Sprague Collection? You know something, Sophia? I believe Barnett College owns the Sprague Collection. Dr. Uberman, fantastic news. Kerner, at last! See what Herr Jones has kindly provided? What on earth? Isn't it amazing? You fool! You come back to show me this, this, this... prehistoric knickknack? Herr Doctor, I believe this knick-knack, as you call it, comes from the lost city. Then we have failed! I see no evidence here of some magical metal plato called Orichalcum! Look here, concealed in the base is a small shiny bead. And it glitters like fire, exactly as Plato described. It's my guess we found the treasure we see. I never guess! We must test! My God! We've done it! The energy of uranium without any radioactivity! And those smug American scientists know nothing! That gives me an idea! Suppose I place this bead inside this statue's open mouth. You saw that? Think of trucks powered by these beads. Think of tanks. Think of airplanes. Use your imagination, Colonel. Think big like the Americans! Think of bombs!
So why are you dragging me in here? Okay, that, w that was interesting. Um, okay. Uh, playlist of all this dialogue should be here. This is Case for Hall. We store all of our junk. We hear one for a spray collection. I'm going to say the top one. Plato's Lost Dialogue should be here somewhere. Need some help? Uh, no thanks. You just get in the way. That's rude. You can't go with me. You don't have tenure. Uh, yes please, it's Gary. Yes. You know what? Come, accompany me. Join me. You are like my partner in crime and my hint system, so yes, join me. Yes, please, it's scary in here. Save the sarcasm, Jones. I'll meet you in your office. Wait, what? So, I asked you to join me, and then you're like, no bueno, okay, 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 I should save. I should save. Save often. Save often. Okay, let's look at the board. It says, where have you gone, Joe DiMaggio? Why does that name ring a bell? Why does that ring a bell? Can I pick it up? I can't pick that up. Okay, so... I guess I've got to go this way. Yeah, stairs. Oh, is there more here? Nope, we gotta go to the stairs. Stairs! Oh, hey. We were here, weren't we? Uh, yeah, at the very beginning. The confusing, like, intro. I believe it's part of the old Ashkenazi collection. Uh, pick up? Oh, a screw. Wait, what? Where? It's screwed in too tight. These itty bitty little things are screws. Okay. Uh, ooh, can I use the mayo, actually, on that? I don't think that'll work. Okay. Uh, pick up. I can't pick that up. Can we look at the screws? It's a screw. Early 20th century, I believe. Okay. So, let's look at books on dig sites. There's nothing of importance here. Look at books on weapons. There's nothing of importance here. Look at books on tools. I think I've read them all. Books on pots. I don't need them. They're just textbooks. Okay. So I guess I use the rope. Okay. So can we pick up the rope this time? I can't pick that up. No, we can't. All right. Uh, can we pick up that arrowhead? Now we can. It's from the Shamit collection. Very sharp. Looks like textiles from the Shamit collection. Uh, walk to shelves. Looks like beadwork from the Phoenix collection. Look at the big crate. The label says unidentified potsherds. Okay. And look at the hole. It's a hole leading to the attic. I don't think that'll work. Uh, oh, look at the totem pole. Marcus thought Potlatch Indians carved this. Looks like a movie prop to me. Slightly frayed, but still strong. Can I use the arrowhead on the rope? That didn't do anything. No. Okay, so I'm guessing I'm done in this area? Oh, I can use the arrowhead on the screws, I think. Use arrowhead the screws. Ouch! The screw came out, but that hurt. Okay, can I pick up the screw? 
no, 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 pick up screw. It's screwed in too tight. Okay, use the arrowhead again. It's screwed in too tight. I can't unless I find a way to protect my hands. Okay, I need gloves. Uh. Okay. Uh, can I go downstairs? Okay, I can. Okay. Ah, the rake. Okay, uh, let's go get the rake, but I know I need to pick it up. It's a greasy old towel. Thank you. Yoink. Uh, can you go get the coal? Uh... A fine sample of bitumen. Can you go get the furnace while we're here? It's hot. Hot, 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 hot. Okay. So let's um, use the rag. Oh, wait, was there something there? Wait, go back, go back, go back. No, I'm just seeing things. I thought there was something here I could pick up. Okay, let's go unscrew that box. Okay, use rag with arrowhead. Use arrowhead with screws. It's unscrewed. And then use arrowhead with screw. It's unscrewed. And then we open the top tipped over bookcase. I can say topped over. I guess same ish. The back of the bookcase is too securely fastened to open. Oh, but I, I got it unscrewed. Uh, push? I can't move it. Pull? I can't move it. Use? I don't think that'll work. Pick up? I can't pick that up. Open? The back of the bookcase is too securely fastened to open. But I... what? Doesn't seem to close. Am I crazy? I... I did the... Screws. Is there one more? Oh, there's one more. Oh my goodness, there's one more. Oh, there's two more. Oh my goodness, there are two more. It's unscrewed. Ah. Oh, it's hidden right along the edges. Son of a It's pickle. unscrewed. Okay, now we open it. There's nothing of importance here. Wait, I did that for nothing. I believe it's part of the old Ashkenazi collection. So I did that unscrewing for nothing? <sighs> I can't pick that up. Okay. It's an old lecture hall desk, complete with a wad of gum, I'll bet. How I feel about this. You sure? There's nothing I can use. I can't move it. I don't think that'll work. Doesn't seem to close. I believe it's part of the old Ashkenazi collection. Well, that's annoying. Okay. Fine game. I did that for nothing. Uh... Okay, um... So I'm missing something. Looks like textiles from the Shamit collection. Shamit. Nothing, nothing, nothing. I think I looked at those shelves. Looks like beadwork from the Phoenix collection. I've already looked at the big crate. Either I'm missing a way to get here. Oh, can I actually, wait, can I push the totem pole? I can't push it any further. Can I pull it? The floor isn't slippery enough. It won't move. Use mayonnaise with the totem pole? Ah, pull totem pole. Totem pole. I, 
Words are great. Ah, okay. There, use totem pole. There we go. Okay, let's look at everything. Urn. Some kind of funeral urn. Can I open it? Oh. I believe it's part of the old Pierce collection. I can I can I pick it up? Feels like there's something loose in here. A key? Dun dun dun. Uh, look at key. It's dusty. Okay. Um It's a stone carving of Shiva. Let's look at a couple more things. It's a crude copy of a Persian idol. And then Wrap it up pretty quick. Poor Marcus. He thought this was a Maasai warrior. Uh, gargoyle? It's a medieval gargoyle, or good imitation. Ah, uh, the chest. I bet you this is the key. Marcus still thinks this chest belonged to Columbus. Okay, I bet you that's what I need the key for. Uh, statue. It's a copy of an Egyptian statue of Horus. Okay, uh, open chess. I can't lift the lid. Use key with chest. I don't think that'll work. Oh, no, it won't. Oh, well, I thought I was on some sort of path. Okay, well, I think this is a good place to end, and also it, I'm going to end it anyways because I'm out of time. Um, interesting game so far. Um... I'm not sure if I'm enjoying it or not. It's interesting. I mean, obviously, it's way better than the first one. Um, but we'll, we'll see how things go. I think this game is slowly warming up um, warming up to me. Uh, words are great. Anywho, thank you guys so, more, so much for watching. Greatly appreciate it. It is shameless plug time. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. Check out my other Let's Plays as well. Including. Including. The first thing, Indiana Jones game. Oh, that was a doozy. That was a doozy of a game. That combat. Oh my goodness, that combat was terrible. Um, yeah, and also I do stream when I can on Twitch. Uh, it's once or twice a week. I'm trying to keep up with a schedule like that. Once or twice, just casual games. Right now, I do have a speed run in mind, but I need to sit down and like work on it. And I just need time to, you know, sit down and do some Mavis Beacon typing skills and write some notes on said speedrun and get some speedruns going. Uh, so right now I'm just playing casual games and rambling to my, my chat. Uh, but anywho, once again, thank you so much for watching. Greatly appreciate it. Hopefully you have a good morning, a good evening, a good night, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.